Hello guys, today we're starting kind of a new series of code reviews on this channel, reviewing different parts and interesting things from open source project called Pinkery. Kind of alternative to Twitter, the author is Nuno Maduro from the core Laravel team. And during Laracon US this year, Nuno announced that this is going open source. And with already more than 1000 stars on GitHub, Believe me, there are a lot of gems to be found in the source code. So I'm not sure how many videos will there be. Will there be like three or 20? We'll see. And today we will start with this artisan command. So there's a custom artisan command to delete non-email verified users older than 24 hours. This is the description. And this is the handle method. Pretty simple, but a few important things we can learn from it. First, how to schedule that artisan command in new Laravel 11 syntax. Then we'll briefly talk about eloquent syntax used here. And then we'll talk about the last part, purge. So what is purge? This is a custom function, by the way, by Nuno Maduro. It's not from Laravel. And we will discuss why the author doesn't use just delete. So step by step first to generate such artisan command, you can just do php artisan make command and typing this name of the command, which will generate the file in app console commands. Now inside of the command in the handle method, you do whatever you want. Now the question is, how do you run that command? Of course, you can do that manually by running this. So php artisan delete and then all the signature of the command but it's also possible to schedule that command. And in Laravel 11, the syntax has changed. So before Laravel 11, there used to be a file app console kernel PHP. That doesn't exist anymore in the new skeleton of Laravel 11. Instead, we go to routes and we have console PHP, which existed in earlier versions of Laravel, but wasn't utilized properly. Now, see the syntax. So if you want to schedule artisan commands, this is the way now in Laravel 11. So one of those commands is exactly this line. Schedule command class of artisan command and then hourly. So this is exactly what is happening in Pinkery project behind the scenes. Every hour it's deleting the non-verified users who didn't perform any actions within the last 24 hours. Kind of a protection against bots in a way, but a general maybe good practice. Maybe in your case, it may be not 24 hours, maybe different condition, but the whole logic, I really agree with that. Now let's go to the condition. Which users are deleted? First, not verified email. So that's kind of the first red flag. Then updated at earlier than yesterday, basically not being active within the last 24 hours. Then three conditions with relationships. Did you know that there's such syntax? So there's where has in eloquent, but also the opposite, where doesn't have relationship and then condition. Again, checking if that user doesn't have any links, questions or questions received earlier than yesterday. This is kind of eloquent, almost basics. And now we're getting to this part. And why is it doing three things? Get each purge. On the first glance, you could maybe think that it's a performance issue because it's better to have just delete here and then it would be one SQL statement. Instead, now we have get all the users, which is one SQL statement, and then doing for each in the memory of all those users in the collection and then deleting the data. Sounds like an optimized thing. But the thing is, if your model, like user model in this case, has some kind of observers or events and listeners, then if you fire mass delete on condition, then observers do not get executed. So that's why in some cases you need to call each with collection function here and call the delete on each user model individually. But in this case, it's not even a delete, it's a purge. What is a purge? If we go to the user model of Pinkery and scroll a bit down, we will find purge as custom function in the user model. This basically it is doing a lot of cleanup for the user before calling the actual delete. And this is kind of my observation about Laravel over the years reviewing different projects is there are so many ways to achieve the same thing. So for example, in here, you could use observer or event and listener or some of the things may be possible on database level with foreign keys like on delete cascade or something like that. But in this case, the author decided to have a special function in the model to perform all of that. So deleting everything related to the user files, relationships, and then even here for some relationships, 
we have each delete because probably this questions model has some observers or events and only then we delete the user kind of a questionable thing maybe it should have been a database transaction i haven't checked all the way what is done in observers or in file deleting process maybe there's more under the hood but in general it's an interesting kind of custom solution to have a model method for deleting the model itself with a lot of data deleted beforehand so now you understand what is that purge in the handle method in the artisan command what do you think about the solution would you have done something differently let's discuss in the comments below i think one of the best ways to learn coding and improve your coding skills is to look at code of others not necessarily learning directly from them but have something to think about maybe to do something differently in the future so i will continue digging in the pinkery open source code and we'll discuss that in the future youtube videos on this channel so subscribe and see you guys in other videos